Widow. The Mushroom Girl. While talking to her, you learn that she has friends in Plan Sect. She wants peace to return to Plan Sect. She spreads her spores around, and her black dress is actually her family attire. Her trait is Versatile Widow. She can always use black magic, singing, service, and plant skills. 33% chance to use Lullaby at the Star Battle. So, the ability to use a lot of different skills isn't actually all that good. And the Lullaby chance isn't that high. So, I don't see it very useful. I mean, it's nice when it activates, but even when it activates, it doesn't always work. So, I'm going to put it at... I'd say it goes in D. It's not very useful at all. As for her play event, she tells a story. She uses the spore dance skill. She gives a flirtatious glance, which is another skill. She gives an item, and she plants a mysterious plant, which damages the entire enemy party. So, that's four out of five good things. So, I think we have no choice but to give it an A. As for her story interaction, she doesn't have much, so C. In the pocket castle, she interacts with Mel. Ah, mushroom. Uh, a slug that has its eyes on me. Even though we are damp comrades, you come here chew on me. Munch, munch. Uh, don't munch on my head! <laughs> oh, did my poison turn things around? As for presents, she likes fruit, vegetables, meat, bread, rice, and sweets, so she'll eat just about everything. Interesting reactions include garlic. I hate garlic. It smells. Potato. I like potatoes. They have a similar feeling. Kids meal. Well, I'm not a kid, but it's pretty good. Gan stew. I'm getting a little dizzy. Wedding cake. Wedding? This makes me sad. Aw, oh, yeah, because she's a widow. Not actually a widow, but that's kind of her theme. Ice cream? It's cold, so it won't be good for my nursery. But it's delicious when eaten. Parfait? Well, this is not for the nursery, but I'll certainly eat it. Coffee? This is one nasty drink. Beer. No alcoholic beverages, please. Jerky. It's dried out, so it wouldn't be good for my nursery. A in the grill arms. It has no nourishment. Cicada shell. Cordyceps is one of my friends. Not that it really matters here. So in other words, there are Cordyceps mushroom girls. That's a terrifying thought. <laughs> Poison mushroom. I am an expert on mushrooms. 
because I am a mushroom. And last but not least, the Chi Papa. This girl for the nursery, but it escaped. Novi, the Novi Stador girl. While talking to her, you learn that she has friends in Plansec, and she wants to become a moth, but she doesn't know what kind of moth she'll become. Her trait is Group Pizuri. She can always use sex craft and insect skills, and skills using chests execute twice but have increased SP costs. So, never underestimate skills that execute twice. The only issue is that her race doesn't get access to that many skills. So, she can't make full utilization out of it. But of course, she can fix that with job still. It's not terribly good. We'll put it at C. Her play events are she creeps around. She throws rocks, which damages the enemy. She falls asleep. And there are two events where she gives separate items. So, that basically neutrals out, so we'll put it at C. And as for story interaction, we'll put her at C. Because she doesn't have much. We haven't gotten anyone she talks to in the pocket castle yet. As for presents, she likes fruits, vegetables, and rice, while she dislikes meat, sweets, and bread. Interesting reactions include the shrimp chili, spicy shrimp, hate shrimp. The Gian stew. Blah, 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 blah. Beer. Alcohol. No. Any of the grilled items. This is bad. Poison mushroom. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Skull. And last but not least, the Chi Papa. Singing. Run away. Frill, the Ursula girl. While talking to her, you learn that she doesn't like to talk. All the wolves are girls. She has one that is clumsy, one that is gentle, and one that is assertive. She has to feed her wolves and tentacles separately. She actually has four wolves under there. And she likes to go fishing. Her trait is Wolf Tentacle. You can always use Beast and Tentacle skills, doing 30% like extra damage and 25% chance of gaining a double action. So 25% chance to act twice on any given turn. That's pretty good. Especially since Scylla's can act, can act several times. So that's really good. Has a lot of nice synergy. Doesn't synergize well with the beasts though. Since beasts use a lot of attack while tentacles use dexterity. But still, synergy aside, it's still pretty good. I think we'll put it at B. For play event, she stops the wolves from fighting. She feeds the wolves. She performs the tentacle dance skill. She gives it an item. And she uses the double bite skill. So that's three positives with no negative. We'll put it at B. It's not quite A level. 
As for story interactions, she doesn't have much, so see. In the pocket castle, she interacts with Pochi. There are wolves underneath your skirt! These girls are part of my body. Please get along nicely. I'm going underneath your skirt too! Uh, hey! No! That tickles! She also interacts with Amara. Oh! You're keeping wolves under your skirt? These girls are part of my body. Aren't they very cute girls? Ah! She bit my hand! Ah! I'm sorry. Do they not get along with fellow wolves? As her present, she likes fruit, vegetables, and rice. I mean, as her present, she dislikes fruits, vegetables, and rice, while she likes meat, sweets, and bread. Interesting reactions include the chili pepper. Spicy! Is this some kind of harassment? Egg. An egg. I'll crack it open and eat it. Kids meal. Are you making... I mean, kids meal. Are you mocking me? Kitty rice. I'm more of a bread person. Sukiyaki. Sukiyaki, how luxurious! Gan stew. What? Are you trying to kill me? Odin. Odin, let's see it together. Mapo tofu. Spicy and tasty. Chocote. I love chocolate, but is there no choco wolf? Wedding cake. A big cake. Can I have it again when I get married? Beer. When I drink alcohol, my lower half goes wild. Any of the grill arms? Much, much. Maybe it was bait wrong? Cicada shell. Where do you pick up this stuff? Poison mushroom. Munch, munch. <laughs> Skull. Ah, what is this? And last but not least, the Chi Papa. The wind spirit. Ah, it ran away. Ooh, rah, rah. The Sliding Door Girl. When talking to her, you'll learn that she is friends with the Moomin. The Fusuma are paper sliding doors. And she usually eats fish. And she is out at sea in order to attack prey. Her trait is Dissolving Cloth. Innate Digestion Strike, 30%. Can always use demon arts, dealing double damage to partially digested foes, and 20% extra evasion and magic evasion. The dealing extra damage to partially digested foes is useless, because you can just insta kale. The extra evasion is pretty nice. The innate uh, digestion strike is pretty nice. So,
Let's still put it at a C. It's not terribly useful. As for story interaction, I mean, as for her play events, she floats around. She uses the dissolving liquid skill. She starts digesting herself, casting the digestion stats on herself. She gives an item, and she gets psyched up. So that's two positive effects with a negative one. Comes out to slightly positive. We'll put it at B. That's her story interaction. She doesn't have much, so C. <clears throat> we haven't got anyone she interacts with in the pocket castle yet. I want to melt someone! If they're bad guys, I can melt them, right? Right. As her presence, she likes meat and rice. And dislikes fruit, vegetables, sweets, and bread. Interesting reactions include tofu. I like tofu. I am a yokai. Strawberry jam. I love strawberries, but I hate jam. Oh, then fried tofu. I'm not a fox, but I'll take it. Flour. When I absorb powder, my absorption power is reduced. Bread. Because I'm a yokai, I don't want to eat bread. Kids meal. I'm not a child. Kitty rice. I'm not a cat, but I like it. Sukiyaki. Wow, gorgeous. Miso soup. I love miso soup because I'm a yokai. Gan stew. My body is melting. Rabbit rice cake. Wow, it's shaped like a rabbit. Beer. I don't like to drink. It makes me woozy. Any of the grilled items. What is this? The roast newt. Is this some kind of ritual? Poison mushroom. Munch, munch. <laughs> Skull. Who melted this guy? And last but not least, the Chiba Pop. Can I release it? Gina, the swordswoman BFR. You never find her, so she has no talk events. Her trait is lively swordsman. Can always equip swords and night swords. Can always use sword skills with half SP costs. 
That really isn't, doesn't help much. We'll put at D. That's not very useful. For a play event, she cares for her weapon. She practices her swings. She gets psyched up, increasing her critical hit chance. Gives an aisle. And she practices her swings, which uh, basically works as a flail wildly. So that's a little bit of positive with no negative, so B. As for story interaction, she has none, so F. <laughs> Will my sword be useful for you, adventurer? Come on, I'm getting fired up. 